27 to tie the game. Huber to hold. Operations clean. And he missed it. 27 yard try by Guskowski. Good snap, and it is yanked. Field goal is no good. And the 27 yard try is pulled to the left. Garrett Hartley to try and win it in overtime. Good snap, good hold, and he missed it to the left. Good snap, good hold, and the kick is pulled. Missed wide left. Had the winner against the Colts to end the game. This one officially 30 yards Weatherford on a hold. And the kick. No good. No good wide left. Wow, last week he won it just barely inside the right uprights. This one hooks left. Trailing by 14, the field goal unit is out there. This will be a 26-yard effort for Jeff Reed from the right hash mark. Sepulveda to holding, Greg Warren is the snapper. The ball is down, the kick by Reed is up, and that kick is no good. It was a knuckleball, and it missed. Janikowski, the 11th-year veteran, to try to bang it through for the game winner. He puts no good. This attempt from 26 yards. Cantrell the holder. And the field goal is no good. Most creative call. Is he ordering lunch or something? Speaking of lunch, Teddy Garcia was out to lunch all year. Here he's missing one of three field goals in the course of the patch of the game against the Bills. Uh, wide left. In fact, Teddy and the Patriots both run up wide left. Fourth down, Shane Graham to attempt a 35-yard field goal. Graham just slid to the left. No good. Down by 10. They'll bring on Graham for a 28-yard field goal attempt. He missed one earlier. And this one he missed as well. Two missed field goals by Graham, and the lead remains 10 with 3.49 left. Point from Phil Dawson. Eight plays, 73 yards. Dawson. Oh, he missed it. Dawson just missed the point after. Wow. Now let's watch the snap to see if it's good. It's right out in front of the holder. Good snap, good hold. And you know what? He overcompensated, gets too much of it, and pulls it wide left. Same distance was the margin of victory in the end. A late field goal. We'll actually make this 34 yards for Dawson. Missed his only attempt earlier. How about this? He had made 27 straight coming into this game and now he's 0 for 2 on the day. And the Cowboys have battled back from an 18 point deficit and the extra point is no good by Beeler. You can't I think this is the right decision by Andy Reid. Makes it an eight-point game of Akers hits from 34. And he does not. David Akers pulls it. He has missed two. Great play. Great play by Charles Demery. 21-yard field goal attempt by Steve Christie. And he missed it. He missed it. He missed the chip shot, Steve Christie. People ask you how you felt and what you thought. You can't remember. What would you feel right now if you're the kicker? I'm glad I'm here. Longwell. And the field goal is no good. Wide right. They did everything but make it. Here comes Billy Cundiff to tie this game in an all-likelihood Senate to overtime. 
The last two years, 16 of 16 in the fourth quarter on field goals. 32 yards to tie. And the kick. Look out! Look out! It's no good! It's no good! There you go. Ball rolled back, and there it is. The bad luck snake somehow comes up, and Pat Shermer's look says it all. The snap is rolled back, and that was the beginning of all drama. Ball is down, though. I think Dawson got distracted. The ball well, is down. It, you know, that's supposed to be automatic, and sometimes it's not. And the kickers get so locked in that when they see the bad snap, when things aren't perfect with them, sometimes they can't get themselves readjusted. Cut back, and there's nothing there. So Carlos, with his second field goal attempt of the day, this one from 24 yards out, Kubiak holding. Carlos is no good. So Kofer apparently is on for a field goal try, a short one of about 19 yards. Kofer to kick. Pelton, the punter, is the holder. Oh, bad snap. And he misses to the left. The snap or the hold confused. They weren't able to spot it, and Kofer hooks it wide to the left. Morton Anderson from 26 yards this time to try to make it 10-6. I don't think he did make it 10-6. He missed it. He pulled it. Here's Graham Gano setting up for a 34-yard field goal attempt from the left hash. Smith places it down. And Gano's kick is off the left upright. So the Redskins come away with nothing on their opening drive. Everybody home, young guys that play ball, don't ever stop your feet, run through the tackle. Wow, wow look at this. Wide left. The 24-yard attempt by Gano. He misses for the second time today. His 10th missed field goal this season. We remain scoreless. For the Saints to stay alive, pending the extra point by John Carney. And he missed no! It. He missed the extra point wide right. Oh my God! How could he do that? McDermott is the snapper, and the kick is no good. Four yards. The 52 yarder set it up, and then the impressive, and this extra point is no good. A huge miss for Blair Walsh, the All-Pro. First miss of the season, and this remains a three-point game here in Texas. For point from Chandler Catanzaro, high snap, and it's not good. One of those guards need to reach up with their hands and make some contact with it. 24-yard attack. Oh, oh he hits the upright. It's no good. He thinks he's won the game. Oh. John Ryan to hold. Oh. And he misses it. That's impossible. <laughs> oh, my God. That is impossible. I did watch them in warm-ups, and they were able to knock him in from about 30. The snap is good. The kick is no good. It gets blown off to the right at the other end of the field the other way. So maybe the timeout didn't work. And Akers misses from 31 yards away. And it's still a seven point game. 36 yard attempt. Patrick O'Donnell is the holder for the win. Gold's kick is no good. Wide to the left. And we are headed for overtime in Chicago. Good snap, good hold, and Bryant's kick is no good.
and he missed it wide to the left. My goodness, that's a huge stop by the Buccaneers. T.J. Reed, you got the coach. How big was that stop at the end of the half? That's good to go into the half with some momentum and got a whole nother half to play. To the Bishop. You don't All think right. he's a little nervous? Romo puts this ball down at the 14-yard line in between the hash marks. This is 24 yards for a 10-point lead. The kick's away from 20. He hit the right upright, and it bounced out no good from 24. He hit the right upright from 24 yards. 24 yards, dead center. And it's why I told you, Brad, Nick Folk would not have been my kicker tonight. High snap. Fiegels gets it down, and it's hooked. Right point after now. And I don't know what happened. It may have been blocked. See if we can tell. Check the hold. No, everything was fine. He just, did he hit the top of the ball maybe? I'm not sure because that just looked like something you just don't see from Phil Dawson, obviously. But he may have kicked the top of the football. 